All right, so for this question, we're going to pretend that we've chosen 10 numbers and we've got three of them um, correct. So out of my 10, only three of mine come up. I think, hey, you know what? Maybe I should win a prize. Look, I've got three of them right. I go up and I realize I didn't win anything. In fact, you have to win four numbers just to get your dollar back. Five numbers, you'll get two dollars, six numbers, and so on until you win some pretty handsome money up there at the top. So why is it I didn't win anything for three numbers? To work it out, I need to establish over here, what is the odds, so I'm going to say, what is the probability of getting three from 10, All right? So that's my probability of the event. So the number of favorable outcomes is going to be asking me, how many ways can I get three from my 10? So looking at this game uh, that we've got here, how many ways could I choose three winners and there are 20 winners to choose from. All right, so again, so there are 20. So 20 choose three. That is how many ways can I choose three of my winners from the pile of winners? Now, because I had a lot of losses, I've got to work out, well, how many ways could I choose my seven losses from the seven, oh, sorry, from the remaining gray squares? So my seven losses from all the possible losses, uh, which there are 60 of them to choose from, means I'm choosing 7 from 60. So I'm going to go 60, choose 7. Now what is the total number of ways I can choose 10 numbers? Well, in fact, there were 80 numbers to choose from, and there were 10 numbers in total. So 80 choose 10. Now, that's something I can just type straight into my calculator. So I'll pull this up over here. I'll go 20, choose, whoops, not that. So 20, choose 3 times 60 choose 7 press equals so it's this number here it's pretty massive I then press divided by 80 choose 10 so 80 choose 10 I press equals and that's my odds of winning so I've actually got a point two six um, chance of winning so as a decimal uh, it doesn't want to show me but that's okay but that's roughly one in four so you've got a one in four chance of winning why is it they haven't paid you? Well, I'll tell you what, you're playing a game that can win potentially millions of dollars. So you're in the running to win one plus million, $10,000, $580, $50, $6, dollars all your money back. So they're not gonna pay you for 25% odds when you are, I guess, in a position where you can win a lot of money on much less odds. Um, because this game is not about um, being fair, this is definitely a business, so they're there to make money. Uh, at 25% odds, you don't win a thing. If you want to play with 25% odds, then you need to come down and play, say, one number. We're getting one number right is a one in, uh, sorry, is a 20 out of 80 chance. So here is where you want to play with 25% odds. To get one number right is 25%. So one in four, they only pay you three. Okay. So in fact, that's probably the easiest way to see the house edge in in effect. So one number would be one of your one of these 20, so 20 winners out of 80, one, uh, 20 out of 80 is, is one in four. Okay, cool.